Over the past few days, we've been discussing the power of the tongue. What we say is key because it helps to form the dreams and visions we hold in our hearts, which shape our future. Today's verse compares the tongues to the pen of a writer, writing out our dreams on our hearts just as a writer chooses how the story goes. If all we talk about are problems, what's wrong with us and the world, and why is it never going to change? We form a very negative vision for our future, and the trouble is we tend to move toward the vision that we hold in our hearts. The good news is we can harness the power of the tongue. Satan would like to use this power against us, but the only way he can do that is by influencing us to speak mistruths, half-truths, doubt, despair, and hopelessness. He wants us to say that the problem can't be solved or the diagnosis is too bad. He wants our focus to be that the odds are stacked against us, but we can choose to focus on the truth. The truth is that every problem can be solved because we have wisdom, favor, and all that we need in Christ to solve it. Sickness has no right to be in our bodies. No diagnosis is beyond the reach of God's healing power. And as believers, that power is within us in Christ. You need to declare what God's word says by speaking out his hope-filled promises. You pen God-inspired visions and dreams on your heart and that will shape your life. God cherishes the moments you spend with him. Take a few minutes each day and talk with him. Let him know how grateful you are and thank him for what he has done. Then ask God to show you the awesome future he has planned for you.